Hello there! As you can see, we are not going to build anything today because, well, there's not a single space where we can still, you know, build something. And that's because this place is finally finished and, well, we're doing our grand tour today. So let's get the basics out of the way. The whole plot is a total of 1.3, 1.4 million dollars and plot data is like 50%, so it's it's still fine, I guess. And well, right now I'm on Main Street because that's pretty much where all the interesting stuff is. We'll, we'll go over there later. So yeah, let's go. So on our left side here, we have this building, which is probably one of my favorites, even though it's not even like furnished. But right next to it, we have this uh, grocery store uh, with these cute displays in front and this very expensive interior. This is like the produce uh, shelf. <laughs> that is like pretty random stuff. Here we have like hygiene uh, stuff and some like <laughs> and some actual groceries we here we have the counters with some snacks and all the register this is supposed to be like the tv that shows the cctv footage even though we don't have any cameras right now because i'm stingy with my money out here we have like this kind of i guess you could use it as like a loading bay probably the best grocery store i've done in a while over here we have the post office which is a bit I mean, it's still nice. I think it's a bit less detailed. It has very, fa it does have very fancy flooring for a post office. But yeah, we have here we have like, um, honestly, I don't really know what these are. I, gu I guess these are like PO boxes or whatever. Then over here we have like a space where you can like package your packages. And here are like the counters, which I've placed in this like weird 45 degree ang angle. I, I guess it looks more interesting. And on the other side we have this. Um, we have a movie theater right here. I think this is one of the first builds I did on this plot. So the interior does look a, it does look a bit outdated. Also, I forgot to put like movie posters right here. And here we have like this kind of lounge area, and like the actual theater bit. It does look pretty nice. I do actually like what I did here. I did have to raise the ceilings quite a bit. So, you know, you don't bump your, bump your head if you're up here. Uh, yeah, so if we continue over here, we first of all have this, uh, we have this cute mail van. Because, you know, we have the post office over here. So, you know, it goes around collecting your mail and stuff. And it's, I, I think I took like um, one of these mini vans and just like modified them a bit in the back. But anyways, here we have the city hotel. This is one of the more recent ones. Here we have like the lobby and, uh, and a hangout spot and a small buffet over here. The rooms are pretty simple. This one just has like a bed and and a sofa. And to be honest, I don't know why this room is so narrow. It feels more like a hallway, but yeah, whatever. So this is like the room you would actually want to stay in. Because f first of all, it has two beds. It's, it doesn't feel like a hallway. It has a nicer bathroom and it has its own like uh, balcony. So you can watch over the town. Then over here, we have a small, uh, we have a small little church. The exterior looks really nice in my opinion, especially like this. Especially Especially like this tower thing, though the though the interior is, is very basic. So this is like the definition of bare bones. Then over here we have like this like cute seafood restaurant. Oh, that's pretty annoying. Then on the interior it has this like cute uh, fish tank. I, I've, I've made this like a cute bench and like these cute table decorations. And then over here we have the very tiny kitchen. Oops, I really regret that I put those uh, shutters there. But now we're right here. If you did not watch the live stream, this is what we uh, put together in that time. So you may remember that there was like a single big building right here. But I didn't really like that one, so I replaced them with these smaller, more traditional looking buildings. Over here in this cute building, we have uh, we have a small we have a small clothing store. I think I should have moved these after renovating, but whatever. It's it's pretty cute. We have these like changing rooms over here. I did forget to put in like a cash register. Then we have this cute building, which somebody pointed out looks a bit like uh, a school because of the clock up here. Yeah, but it's actually like a, a small like tourist information center. We have like these brochures and stuff. If you visit this place for the first time so you can like inform yourself on what to do or whatever it also has this couch which is very why did i why did i place it like that it's probably my least favorite interior it's very basic if we walk down this uh, this promenade we have this place i think it's like um, a grill even though i clearly did not put a grill into this kitchen oh well yeah, and then this building is like 
it, it kind of hides the kitchen. It's probably the least interesting uh, building over here. But yeah, that's basically like the downtown area done. But then if we walk over this uh, custom bridge I've made, we come into the more suburban part of the boat, I guess. Yeah, I guess we'll start over here. So these are like the uh, suburbs. And I mean, there's not really a lot of... <laughs> there's not really a lot I can say. Because, you know, these... I, I didn't furnish any of these buildings because I... Because, I mean, nobody's ever going to visit this place over the downtown area. So, you know, why bother? So, uh, so if we uh, uh, cross the road and go over here, this is our little historic lighthouse. So if we, oops, oh why did, <laughs> I really regret putting these everywhere. Can I please? Thank you. So this is like a, a little like souvenir shop. We have like these little souvenirs. This is like I try I try to make like a mini replica of the building. If if you get what I mean. You have to know what it is to recognize it. <laughs> yeah, but anyways. Uh, and over here we have like a small little cafe. Then here we have like a changing room if you want to go for a swim. And, and some showers. And then finally we have the beach over here. We do have like a really nice view over the town. But yeah, that's pretty much the entire build. Oh great, now it started raining. But yeah, that's it. I do have some pretty exciting plans for what to do after this series. So stick around for that. Uh, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.